firm to do something called a structural assessment. And based on what that firm finds, we'll decide if this building can be saved and if it's worth it. A month ago, investigators said a squatter trying to keep warm likely started a fire in the building. Since the city acquired the warehouse in 2007, it spent between 50 and 60,000 taxpayer dollars to shore it up, paint the facade, and make other repairs. The city came close to tearing the building down eight years ago, but didn't because the Historic Preservation Commission argued it's an important part of South Bend's heritage. The city knows demolition might be inevitable at this point, but it's hiring this firm to take one last look and help figure out the options. If I were a betting man, I think the, the, the results are going to come back. The building is not structurally sound. So the question then is, what would it cost to keep the facade and attract a developer to, to do that? The city says the firm hired to do the structural assessment will be paid no more than $48,000. I'm Kelly Stopsinski, WSBT 22 News. It is South Bend.